Hey guys, Alex here with Trilby Gaming, bringing you the very next episode of the Croc 2 Let's Play. In the previous episode, we managed to defeat an enormous plant, and we redid a race, despite the fact that I still lost it. Um, and in today's episode, we have a wonderful little level that I haven't quite done yet, called Save 50 Trapped Gobbos from something. And 50 is a fairly large number, so I have a funny feeling we may be doing this for some time. And there's fire. Um, but yeah, so if you're enjoying the Croc 2 Let's Play, then oh wow, this guy's got fire everywhere. Uh, that was unexpected. Uh, <laughs> yeah, if you're enjoying the uh, Croc 2 Let's Play, then please let me know down in the comment section down below. Uh, hit a like. If you don't, give it a dislike. That's absolutely fine. And let's, I guess, get lost. How do I how do I save you? How do I save you? I'm gonna assume that fire is bad. Why is my camera being weird? I'm gonna assume that fire is what? <laughs> Where did you come from? Okay, I I I. What am I supposed to do? Seriously now, what am I what am I supposed to do? Fire kills me, I assume. Yes. Can I jump over? I can. And it still damages me, but it's fine because we've got loads of life, apparently. And somehow we've got two gems as well. How do we... Is there water somewhere that I need to... Oh! Okay. So apparently I can get water in my pot. Really? Oh, really? It's... <laughs> so I actually have to use a button to use that. I can only hold four pieces of water at once. So there was obviously some water back there. <laughs> I completely... Really? Oh, my life. Okay. So, fire is hot. Fire is hot. Um, wait, are the gobos gems as well? Maybe that's how it works. Because I've got four gems and four gobos. So there are only 50 gems in this level, I guess. Right, I can get you. I can get you as well. So I don't need to be so close to it. Die. <laughs> right. So, we can save you guys. So I get six gems. Yep, okay. So... Got loads of gems in this. And there's a secret gem. I can roll with that. I can roll with that. And then we pick up some water. Cool. So this level seems fairly, fairly straightforward. Nothing, nothing too bad to worry about here. I don't have to carry them anywhere, which is nice. I just have to, I guess, turn off all the fire. Um, let's go down here. So considering there are 50 of them, there's obviously going to be some backtracking involved. That's going to be fun. <laughs> so, okay, so the fire that they shoot is like a stream, so that's how it works, like, a stream of fire that I then need to deal with. Oh, okay. I know, I, no, I don't want to sidestep, because I've got loads of these. Yeah, check it out. I might actually, I might actually get the, um, uh, the trophy for this actually in the level, which would be quite nice. That would be quite nice, considering, so I've been thinking about, like, no, wrong one. No, side. Ah, there we go. So I was thinking about the um, um, the footage we lost and all of that wonderful fun stuff. So what I'm probably going to do is recap those levels in the completionist episode and um, uh, just do it then. Because to be fair, completion episodes are generally pretty short, so I can just throw that in. And I'm just going to jump on it. Okay, I'm not going to jump on this. There we go. That's nicer. Come on, let's have a little bit of fun while we can. Um, so yeah, I'm probably just gonna, uh, gonna go around, whoa, hey, check it out, avoiding the fire like an absolute boss, absolute crocodile boss, uh, there's one up there, can I reach it? No, I can't, um, yeah, so as I was saying, I'm just gonna, uh, I'm just gonna do it in the completion episode, I'm sorry, I guess this is just sometimes what happens, first, uh, first, first time it has happened that I've lost footage, it's a pain in the neck, but I guess... That's how it goes sometimes, right? That's just how it goes. Um, admittedly, it would make a lot more sense if the gobos were worth two gems each, because then there wouldn't be any gems in this level, but like, oh, there's a blue one. I'm checking all of these now. We are already like three gems in. That I will take it, I will take it. Oh, what is this? Okay, it's just mud. It's like the mud from Crash Bandicoot. Like, I will walk slowly. I save you, I save you. I'm stuck in, okay. I'm stuck in the mud! 
like the game everybody used to play as kids, where you had to like, if you got, if uh, you got tagged, you had to, uh, had to stand still with your legs outstretched and uh, wait for someone to walk through your legs. Walk through your legs? Crawl, crawl under your legs. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm gonna pick you up and then. I'm still not getting used to the controls on this. <laughs> I'm absolutely terrible. Right, Mecha Gobbo. Mecha Gobbo away! Right, where's we going? Where we going? Where we going? Oh, sweet. Free gem. I can do that. So, four gems. Where's the. Is there anything else along here that I need to get? Anything else I need to get? Ha! Ah, give me the life! Give me sustenance! Yes! Wow, I am low on health already. That is ridiculous. Oh, yeah! Do you want to know why? <laughs> So of course in the last episode we we beat the boss. Yeah. Spoiler alert! If you haven't seen the last episode, then go back and watch it. What are you doing here? Um Yeah, we beat the boss and we beat the boss in such incredible fashion. Oh. Is there anywhere up here? I'm now I'm I'm now like paranoid of checkpoints as well. No, nothing, okay. Um yeah, we beat the boss in such incredible fashion that we had a hundred gems and ooh. Oh, that's just platforms. Um, that we had 100 gems, and that's brilliant. So, that was great. And then we uh, we unfortunately... Oh, uh, no, no. We, uh... <laughs> so I then start recording today's episode. And OBS does it again. And it stops... Re it isn't recording video. And thankfully, I managed to pick up on it. I don't know what it is. Clearly, something's going on that I'm missing, and I need to, uh, I need to update it or something. But, um... But yeah, there was. Uh, it stopped me from. Uh, it stopped me from recording the video, which is a real pain in the neck. So I actually started running through this level just a little bit and lose my life. No wait, no I didn't. No I didn't. No I didn't. What am I chatting? <laughs> I'm chatting total nonsense because it's not that at all. This was me being a total idiot in the beginning and just running through fire. And of course, crocodiles aren't exactly the, the most adverse at, um, the most adverse at running through fire. So naturally, poor croc was taking some serious damage from my complete and total idiocy. Um, so yeah, it's, it's not me and messing up recording. I mean, like, you know, messing up recordings happened anyway, but like, it, I didn't lose any lives over it. Wow, I am just being... I don't even know how stupid, I don't even know how stupid today, um, but there you go, there you go, right, so 33 out of 50, what's down here, what's along here, there's nothing along the sides that like I'm missing, there's no gem up here, no, but there is some water down there, ooh, bye, right, we're getting there, we're getting there, we're only new 15, this was actually surprisingly faster than I expected it to be, Surprisingly faster than I expected it to be. Ah, there you are. There you are. Do you wanna know what though? Do you wanna know what? Do you wanna know what I'm thinking? Serious question right about here, guys. Like, Croc's backpack is flipping tiny. How the hell is he carrying, like, four, I guess, water splats? <laughs> He's obviously got some kind of bucket. Um. Uh, ow. How is he carrying all the water? And now there's a key. Do I, can I throw water on the camera, please? No, I can't. Um, <laughs> um, how is he carrying all this water? 37 gobbos, a multitude of sweets, and a mechanical gobbo. All in that tiny backpack. Like, I mean, come on. I know Hermione Granger has some, like, um, some serious bottomless purse issues, but like, wait, can I get out there? I can. Yeah, see, see, that's what I need. This key and this heart and this gem. Damn, that's all five. Check it out. We are doing this in the level. Right, right, right. Real talk for a sec, real talk. If I mess this up, I'm going to be livid. I'm actually going to be livid. Wait, that's, that guy's tiny. That guy's tiny. That guy's really, really small. Why is he so small? Oh, wow, that actually hurts me. That Dantini is tiny. Is that actually a thing? Do they resize the... I guess they did. I guess they did. Right. I hate these physics sometimes. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. Was a tad worried. Not gonna lie. Gotta do it again. Okay. 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 
Real talk, real talk. Like the trophy is like right there. It's right there. My heart is actually having palpitation. Yes! Got it! Right! Excellent! That's another level we don't have to do in the completion list. Wait, why am I? Have I run out of water? Have I run out of water? Have I seriously run out of water? Apparently I've run out of water. Oh, no, I haven't. What? What was that? I need the water. Oh wait, I need I also need to go back and actually collect these people. I am gonna go and collect these people. Um yeah, just like, this guy's got some serious bag- This guy's got some serious baggage. I know he's like tiny, but like, come on. I mean, to be able- Even if, right, for example, even if, for some miraculous nonsense, he can actually hold all of these items in his bag at once, this thing's gonna weigh a ton. I mean, like, these poor gobbos are like squished together in this tiny thing. Like, the weight is gonna be insane. Even if, like, you know, the sheer fact that they're squashed together in a tiny backpack doesn't just kill them immediately. Unless, like, you know, just magic them disappearing and then reappearing in the village, even though I don't think we see them in the village. Although, if I go back into the village and there are gobos everywhere, I'm gonna be so pleased. That would be really, really cool. But there you go. I don't think it will be. I don't think it will be. Cool. Wait, is this just... No, this is platforms, isn't it? Yeah. Right, so we've got some platforms. We've got some platforming in a platformer game. Yay! So there's four that we're missing. There's four we're missing. Where are they? Because I, I have absolutely no idea where I'm at right now. Absolutely no idea. But there is water here and water there. Cool. Um, hmm. Wait, is this the beginning? No. Is this the beginning? This is the beginning. Is this the beginning? Is that actually the beginning? Oh, okay, okay. Okay, real talk for a sec. Well, I did say there was gonna be some backtracking involved. I did say there was gonna be some backtracking. Go away, fire. Um, hmm. I'm glad that the game remembers where I put out all the fire, though. That's gonna help with some navigation. Um, but it's not like I've left a trail of breadcrumbs, so I don't exactly know where I'm going. Go away, fire. Uh, let's get rid of you. What? What? Wait, wait, wait. Zero out of nine? No. No. There's not a free heart up here anymore. No. Uh, this is not good. This is not good. This is not good. All I've got to do is mess up one thing and I've got to redo this entire level. Entire level. Wait, that means I don't keep... <sighs> I think that means I lose this trophy as well. You are kidding me. You are absolutely kidding me if that's the case. Right, no, everything's going to be fine. Everything's going to be fine. Everything is going to be fine. Croc, run like a normal person. What is all of this jagged, like, stop starting all the time? That's got to be killer on your knees, mate. That just, that just doesn't look comfortable. Right, climb the wall. Climb in the wall. Cool. Oh, yup. Like a cute little crocodile that you are. Um, I know we've got all the water we need. We have got all the water we need, right? Yeah. There was a gem up there. What else is there? Oh yeah, here's the here's the the wonderful the wonderful mud. The wonderful mud. I'm just gonna take it easy, you know, take the mud simple. Absolutely fine. Walking through transparent mud uh log. Absolutely fine. Um is there like a corner that I missed or something? No. Um hmm. We did the mecha gobbo bit. And I got the heart, not that the heart has saved me. Well, to be fair, I guess to be fair, if I hadn't gotten those hearts, I'd have died earlier. There's not one around here. Where else is one? Where else is one? Those are the platforms there. What did I miss? Hmm. And now the music's gone, which is kind of eerie. Oh, literally, as I mention it, it comes back. Um, hmm. Oh, great. Crud, 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 crud. Run away, run away, run away. 
Okay. Oh, this looks new. This looks new. This looks new. What? Wait, what? Oh, they're over there. How do I get there? Um. Okay. Right. There's water. Water doesn't give me life, unfortunately. I swear I saw fire earlier, so now I'm a little bit more cautious. Wait, and we're here. What? So, so, okay, okay, slow down a second. I need to somehow just, like, fly. Is that what you're telling me at the minute? That what you're telling me? Oh, crud. Bye. I'm gonna go up this tree. I am up the tree. I am down the tree. Balloon. Where does the balloon take me? Wait, wait, it was the key. It was the key. I remember picking up the key all along. All along. Right, now the question is, if I pick up these four now, do I just instantly win? Please tell me I instantly win. No, I don't. I now- Oh, no, wait, it just- it just shoots to 100. <sighs> oh, absolute sigh of relief, I have to say. I have to say. Because, like, if I'd have died and lost the trophy, the, um, like, everything else, I would have been- I would have been livid. I would have been absolutely livid. But you know what? You know what? This bit, you know, you guys know what I'm doing. I'm just gonna cut this back to the exit. And there it is, guys. And there it is. Oh, uh, that was beaut. Wait, what? Oh, <laughs> oh! I thought it had actually frozen for a sec. Oh, we got cutscene. <laughs> it's like the Disney song. Hellfire. <laughs> Village mashing auto. That's a dinosaur. That is just a dinosaur with a new jaw. That's not really a. That's not really an automaton, to be honest. Not really what I had in mind. But it's not ready. <laughs> Your meanness. It's not ready! Well, it seems to walk at least. And it does whatever that was. <laughs> I definitely would not call that a roar. That was that was something, but it definitely wasn't a roar. Oh no, no, cute caveman gobo, what's wrong? What's wrong? Wait, where is this? I don't actually think I've been here yet. Okay, nothing's wrong, you're just jumping. Is that just what they do? They just like look at each other and jump. Going into a cave. Okay. Hmm. Cutscene action. Some real cutscene action. Oh wait, I'm in it already. The village masher. The village masher. Okay. Well, I suppose today's episode is going to be a little bit longer then, because we got to we got to go and destroy the village masher. Ow. <laughs> or just burn our tails along the way. Why not? Great. So this is another obviously another opportunity to get gems. There wasn't any gems over there, I don't think. Do you know what? Do you know what? The game gave me this tool, I'm gonna make use of it. Where are my binoculars? Nope, I don't think I think we're good. I think we're good. What I find really interesting as well is it doesn't really do it from Croc's perspective, it's like elevated. So it's almost as if he like he puts the binoculars up above his head. Are they just like is it like a periscope rather than binoculars? <laughs> Oh, do you know what? Who knows? Who knows? It's got first person in the game. I'll take- Whoa! Was not ready for you. Uh, more darkness, more skeletons. This is going to be fun. There's going to be like a- Oh! There's going to be like a billion of these things, isn't there? This in low light is actually really annoying. Trying to do this is really annoying. Wow, okay. But you know what? You know what? We busted. I can't even jump on this now. Um, yeah, you know, we're doing alright. We're doing alright. We're doing alright. Cool. Cool. Oh, another skeleton. Yeah, yeah. This is fine. This is fine. Picking up some money. Hopefully gonna get some gems. Some gems? Some, uh, some life. You know, we're all good. I'm fairly certain there'll be another two of these to make 50 and then, you know, 20, 20. Oh, there you go. So I think this door, this door is it. This door is it. 
I think this is where we fight the village mashup. <laughs> wow, what a name. They weren't exactly the best at naming conventions when these games were built, were they? But, uh, but you know what? Okay, we got 50. This is going to be it. This is going to be it. Let's go. Yep, see? Loading screen mid-level. Mid we know that this means that there is a boss. And I have absolutely no idea what to do. Fill bucket water, throw water at monster. Okay, cool. Hello, dinosaur! This is gonna be nice and easy. Oh, he does brief fight. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm gonna run away from you now. <laughs> I'm in the water, you cannot touch me! Run, 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 run. Pick up bucket. So I have to actually physically pick up the bucket. Okay. There's water in it now. Oh, I just have to throw it in, I guess. Right. Let's go! Hold on. What? You mean that didn't do anything? Have I actually got to do it in his face? Oh, I've got to do it in his mouth. I've got to do it in his mouth. That's going to be fun. That's going to be fun. Okay. <laughs> this is going to be fun. I love how it also like comes out immediately. Just like the... Oh, fuck. The bucket has a complete mind of its own. Come on, give me another bucket. Give me another bucket. There we go. There we go. Give me the bucket. Give me the bucket. Bucket has water. Bucket comes back like a... You see, yo-yo bucket. Oh, guys, I think I've got the title for this episode. Yo-yo... Oh, really? Really? Yo-yo bucket. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on. This dinosaur is making absolutely no attempts to deal any damage to me whatsoever. But I'll take it. I'll take it. Yeah! Yeah! I somehow didn't take damage from the fire, but okay. Okay, cool. So that's basically going to be this boss, everybody. <laughs> Absolutely easy. No worries at all. Come on, look at me, look at me, look at me, look at me. Oh, camera. Oh, okay, okay. Look at me, look at me. No. Go! Yes! Right, one more, one more, one more, one more, one more. Oh, run away. I can see you from, like, behind, almost. As if you're hunting me. Because, you know, like, I don't know. Maybe your intention is to do some damage to me. But I'll take this. I'll take this. I just realized I haven't been given any gems so far. Look at me! I want you to look at me when I kill you. Ah! Oh. Ah! <laughs> What is this nonsense? Give me the bucket. Give me the bucket. Cool. There's literally fire everywhere. I think this is, this is literally, in all honesty, this is the worst boss in the game. Dot. That I have fought so far. This is the worst boss. This is easy, uninteresting. Wow. Apparently I just took extra damage for no reason. Whatever. The dinosaur's down. That was really boring. <laughs> <laughs> Caveman Village. Right, we are back in the village. So, and we've got full because we just beat a boss. So, hooray, big metal monster, he big menace. Wait, really? That was it? That was it? That was this, that was this world? Are you kidding me? <laughs> ah! Okay, so of course I know that um, two levels have been missed out because of course footage I won't, I'll stop mentioning it now. Um, but yeah, it appears that we're now going on to the fourth and I believe final world. So let's, you know, let's have a quick look. Let's have a quick look. We'll, um, you know, we can run around the hub world a little bit and uh, get into the, uh, in, get into the final world in the next episode. Come on. Inca. Inca gobos. Let's do it. Let's go. Come on. Take me there. Cool. I don't quite know how the cat's going to take me there in his shop, but okay. Magical crystal ball stuff. Inca village. Okay. I can roll with Inca village. Oh, wow. That headset's cool. Who would you be? <laughs> Long lost parents. Vanished in... Oh, the plot thickens. The vanished inventor, who we just so happen to have seen at the in the cutscene at the beginning of the game. 
Oh, this is kind of cute, you know? Oh, what do you want? Why are you topless? I like ginger soda. <laughs> Hit X as many times as you can to drink soda, then burp. Oh my god, get ready. Let's go, mate. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I win. I win. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. That's brilliant. Yeah, give me the money. That was well worth <laughs> Oh, that was brilliant. Oh, stone gobbos. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. I kind of like this place, actually. That's cool. This place actually looks really cool. I don't recognize this from my childhood at all, so I don't think I ever made it to these levels at all. Um, but this is cool. I can I can, I can, can get behind the... Um, um, I can get behind this. Can I just roll up it? Yep. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, but it's locked. So that's probably a boss room. Um, yeah. Can I just slot down? No. I can't even, like, jump off it. The game doesn't recognise I've hit the floor. Um, oh wow, okay. And there's a baby gobbo. Okay, do you know what? Do you know what? Do you know what? I'm exploring far too much. After we burped this guy into oblivion, I am... <laughs> I am going to call it that. Right, so that's game, guys. If you enjoyed today's episode of the Croc 2 Let's Play, then, uh, then please leave a right rating down below. Um, if you didn't, give it a dislike. That's absolutely fine. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Give me some feedback. Um, and hey, if you want to see a little bit more of me, then hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell so you know when I'm uploading. And, um, and yeah, guys, take care of yourselves. And until next time.